Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Lords of the Fallen with me, Bring It Down. I can't lock onto that guy. I wasn't looking for a fight there. Activated that to top off my health, and I didn't top off my health. Should have parried that. Okay. The shield bash always catches me off guard. It comes out so quick. They don't do it very frequently. Alright. This is going really well. Pretty sure that room has a spider in it. Right. 
Let's play it a little safe. I'm going to call the catacombs done for now. We're going to come back here later anyway. A couple times, I think. One, to upgrade the sword that we eventually find. Alright, so this is not the exit I want to take. Might not be the exit that I want to take. The exit I'm gonna take, though. I don't have to go back through the catacombs. Oh, it's just a level up. I have all that experience from the champion boss fight. So we need our faith at 21 for the max level of Quake. So, there are a finite amount of spell points you can invest. It may not be worth using experience to level up the spells. Because you can find those uh, spell point shards. But I think it's fine. For right now, anyway. This is always these we can get, I guess. Actually, I don't know if you invest in these or not, if you're not that class. So close. Alright, more endurance. Try some parrying here. Guy has the faster attacks. Oh, cool. Worked. I spammed it. <laughs> no finesse.
You're right, buddy. Did we go that way? We have not gone this way yet. So instead of going the graveyard and the Rogar realm, we can go this way. Let's time that a little bit. There he is. Wow, we didn't one-shot the guy. Not too shabby. I open the chest by putting a rune in the slot. the Guardman X. Also, I remember having a lot of trouble with this area in my first playthrough. That is a great X. Oh, two rune slots. That's pretty good. Also, this staff does scale with faith. Might make it worth using. Attack speed is 110%. Oh, this guy's a 10% faith. It's pretty good. Anyway, uh, the Guardman X. Blocking with a weapon is usually not very effective, but with the blade so big, the Great Axe appears to be working surprisingly well. Oh, 85% lock defense. Pretty solid, yeah. Yeah, same moveset as a Clawfinger as a Great X. The Clawfinger's range attack, one would do more damage with it, and then the range attack itself. There's two of these guys. That is good utility. Almost messed up there. All right, we got the blind hammer. It looks a little goofy. But just the onus covers the eyes of the infested. A piece of cloth covers the eyes that were once sculpted on the head of this club. That's poison damage, too. Why do I keep doing this? So we can't enter the Citadel yet. It's fine. We have to go to the Rogar realm first. 
So that's what we'll do. Sweet. <laughs> That's what I like to call a two for McDoofer. Easily tell if you're going to get back up because you'll get experience the first time you knock him down. So I could get, can, uh, excuse me, I could continue going that way. I can guess what I was going to say. And, um, avoid the fights up here, but. Did we do this one? No. Or, yeah, we have done this one. The two we haven't done. Well, it's not this one. It is one of the catacombs, and... Where's the other one at? The cellar, maybe? Oh, this one. So yeah, the uh, catacombs in this one. Pretty sure once we're done with the Rogar Realm, this one will be available. I can't believe it. It's not a chamber. It's a whole other world. It looks familiar, but... Like a child's memory, it's twisted, broken. That ray of light, is this the device you're looking for? Well, never mind. Off to get some treasure. Find his keepers. Now I go back to using symmetry. I can fast roll in Living Legend. And it just gives me extra armor. I don't know if that's worth it. I mean, it looks cool. That by itself is worth it. There he is. Hideous. He took his leaden sword in hand. You can speak. As can you. Imagine my surprise. What are you? What are you? I don't know. 
I do not abide the mortal laws. I left the realm of men a hundred lifetimes ago. I do not have a name. I don't remember it. And it does not matter here. You left the realm of men? From the moment the universes were born, they began to die. It's inevitable. Nothing stays the same. Even you are changing in this moment. Right in front of me. And I in front of you. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Something is searching for me. Something of high value. It will arrive by and by. What do you mean? It will come when the Rogar go. The Rogar are not leaving any time soon. Coming and going, going and coming. It makes no difference to me. What is this precious thing you seek? It is a crystal, a very special crystal. A crystal that can rend a tear between the realms. A tear powerful enough to distort other ruptures. The Rogar could be using that crystal to enter our world. You will find the crystal itself in the place of power. A place where all energy gathers. Take it away, and the Rogar Lords will travel no more. Then, bring it back to me. Yes. Are you a smith? These tools... Are you a smithy of some sort? In some ways, yes. You could say so. I do have dealings with weapons and the like. Craft something for me. You ask me for a glass of water, and I could give you the ocean. Give me the ocean, then. Show me one of your runes, and with this rune, you can imbue any weapon you like. Alright, breaking sealed runes. I don't really care for the smaller runes, at least not in this situation. We just use those to open chests and doors and... Shoot, I should have done that for the, these. Ah, it's fine. What do the runes say when they speak to you? Tell me about Dimension Travels. Tell me more about your dimension travel. It would take a thousand years to explain. Give me the short version. Short version would involve me not being human anymore. Alright. Uh, can I equip runes any of my current equipment? I don't think so. All right, so this will give me a physical defense bonus, poison defense, and equipment capacity. Don't need the equipment capacity right now. You always take them out later, so there's no reason not to equip them. I think that one is a waste, so we won't bother with that. I think there's a save point up ahead. Yeah, that's my left. And a couple of side paths. I think my favorite set of armor and weapon is in this area. But we'll deal with that next time. For now, I'm going to call it here. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one.